If your GPU isn't giving you the performance you know it should, then this video is exactly what you need. Today, I'm showing you a complete step-by-step -step guide to fully optimize your GPU for smoother gameplay, higher FPS, and zero lag, no matter what game you're playing. So buckle up, hit that like button, and let's unlock your GPU's true power. Frustrated with the lag and hyping while you play games? So guys, you need Gear Booster. This is the ultimate tool to lower your ping, boost stability, and give you zero lag. Pro players like Asian Jeff and Polarized to use it to stay ahead. So why not you? Download Gear Booster now from the link in the description and dominate every match. To begin optimizing your GPU for better gaming performance, we'll start by tweaking the Windows registry to prioritize your graphics card. Open the Windows search bar, type in Registry Editor, then right-click it and select Run as Administrator. Copy the first registry path provided in the video description paste it into the top address bar of the registry editor and press enter to go straight to the necessary directory. Once you're there, find the entry labeled system responsiveness, right click it, choose modify, set the value data to zero and make sure the base is set to hexadecimal. This change helps shift more focus toward your GPU while gaming or using graphics heavy software, unlocking better performance and smoother gameplay. Click OK to apply the change. Next, copy and paste the second registry path from the description and hit enter. This location includes multiple keys that allow you to customize how Windows manages GPU usage during gaming. These values are crucial for balancing system performance with graphical demands. First, locate the key named GPU Priority. Double click on it and in the edit window, set its value to eight. This tells Windows to assign the highest priority to GPU processing, which can lead to more consistent frame rates and better graphical responsiveness. Now find the key labeled Priority, open it and change its value to 6. This boosts the importance of gaming-related tasks over background apps, helping to reduce stutters and input lag during gameplay. After that, locate Scheduling category and change its value to High. This ensures that graphics tasks are scheduled with low latency in mind, giving you faster rendering and a more responsive in-game feel. Lastly, modify SFIO priority by setting its value to high as well. This controls system level input output operations. Raising its priority improves how efficiently your GPU communicates with the rest of your system, which is especially helpful in fast paced games that require quick data handling. Now let's wrap things up by disabling GPU power throttling to make sure your graphics card operates at full performance without any unnecessary limits. Go ahead and paste the third registry path from the description into the registry editor's address bar and hit enter. In this location, look for a key named power throttling off. If it's already there, double click it and set the value to one to disable any kind of GPU power saving restrictions. If you don't see the power throttling off key, don't worry. Just right click in the blank space, choose new, then select DWORD 32 bit value and name it exactly as power throttling off. After creating it, double click to open it, change the value to 1 and press OK to save. This tweak ensures that your GPU won't be limited by Windows power management, allowing it to push full performance during gaming. Once done, you can close the registry editor and restart your PC to apply all the optimizations. Let's jump into the next step to boost your GPU usage for smoother and faster gaming. For this, you'll need the ultimate low GPU usage fix pack on your system. You can easily download it using the link provided in the description. You're welcome to scan the pack using any trusted antivirus software. It's 100% clean and safe. Once it's downloaded, extract and open the folder to get started. Go ahead and open the GPU optimization directory. Inside, locate the clear.bat file. This script is designed to remove temporary junk files and refresh core Windows settings that may be slowing down your system. Right click the file and then select Run as Administrator. This cleanup helps free up resources and allows your GPU to work more efficiently. Next, find the file called Gaming Optimization Registry. Double click it, select Yes, and then hit OK. Now you'll see two optimization options Low Med Optimization and Med High Optimization. Choose the one that best matches your system's specs. If your PC is low-end or mid-range, go with the low-med file. If your hardware is more powerful, the med-high option is ideal. Not sure which one to pick? Drop a comment below and I'll help you choose the right one for your setup. 
For now, I'll select Low Med Optimization to improve performance on budget systems. Once selected, confirm with Yes, then OK to apply the registry tweak. Now, head over to the GPU Thread Optimization folder. Here, you'll see different registry files tailored for AMD, Intel, and NVIDIA graphics cards. Pick the one that matches your GPU brand. Since I'm using an NVIDIA GPU, I'll go with the NVIDIA Thread Optimization file. Double-click it, approve with Yes twice, and press OK to apply the settings. This tweak helps manage how your GPU handles threading, leading to better load balancing and more consistent FPS during gameplay. Now we'll use a few essential tools to unlock even more GPU performance. Start by opening the Tools folder and head into the Throttle App directory. Launch the Throttle Stop application. Once it's open, you'll see several power profiles like Performance, Game, Internet and Battery Mode. Since our goal is to maximize GPU efficiency for gaming, go ahead and select the game profile for optimal results. Now make sure to check the box labeled High Performance. A list of power plans will appear. Stick with High Performance as it ensures your system focuses all its power toward gaming tasks. Just find and tick Disable Turbo to reduce unnecessary thermal spikes that might throttle GPU usage. After that, click the Turn On button and then hit Save. Throttle Stop should now be running in the background. You can safely minimize it. It will launch automatically each time you boot your PC. Next, go back to the Tools folder and install MSI Afterburner. Once it's installed, open it to access the main interface where your GPU settings are displayed. Start by adjusting the power limit and temperature limit. Move both sliders all the way to the right to unlock your GPU's full thermal and power capabilities. Do not modify anything in the core voltage section. Just leave that untouched to avoid instability. Then move to the memory clock section. Begin increasing it gradually in steps of 20 MHz. For example, if the value starts at zero, try increasing it to 20 or 40. After each change, test your system's stability by running a game. If everything runs smoothly, your GPU is handling the increased memory speed, which will translate to better in-game performance. Once satisfied, click Apply to save your new configuration. Finally, open the MSI Mode Utility folder. Right-click the application, select Run as Administrator, and confirm when prompted. When the utility opens, find your GPU model in the list. Select it, tick the MSI box, and set the priority to High. Once you've made the adjustments, click Apply to finalize the changes. These tweaks will significantly improve how your GPU handles gaming tasks, resulting in a more stable frame rate and smoother overall gameplay. To get started with Gear Up Booster, download the tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the middle server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the Not tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to Automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Another key step to push your GPU to its limits is by fine-tuning your power plan settings for performance. Start by opening the Windows Search and typing Power and Sleep settings, then click to open it. Once inside, look to the right side of the window and select Additional Power Settings. This will bring up a new window showing all available power plans. From here, choose the High Performance Power Plan. This plan ensures your system is focused on delivering speed and performance, not power saving. Next, click on Change Plan Settings next to High Performance, and then choose Change Advanced Power Settings. This will open a detailed settings menu where we can adjust important values that directly affect GPU performance. In the Advanced Settings window, expand the Hard Disk section 
and change turn off hard disk after to zero. This prevents your hard drive from powering down during idle moments, which helps maintain faster access and smoother gameplay transitions. Now expand the processor power management section. Set both the minimum processor state and maximum processor state to 100%. While this primarily boosts your CPU, it also prevents background slowdowns that can indirectly throttle GPU performance, keeping everything running at full speed. Finally, find the system cooling policy section. Make sure it's set to active. This setting allows your system fans to respond aggressively to heat helping prevent thermal throttling, which can cap GPU performance during longer gaming sessions. Once you're done, click Apply and then OK to save all the changes. These tweaks will ensure your power settings are fully aligned with gaming performance, giving your GPU the environment it needs to perform without limitations. Now let's fine tune a few extra Windows settings to squeeze out even more GPU power. These adjustments are designed to give you smoother gameplay, higher FPS and a more responsive experience while gaming. Start by right-clicking anywhere on your desktop and selecting Display Settings from the menu. Once the Display Settings window opens, scroll down until you find Related Settings and click on Graphics Settings. This will open a dedicated panel for managing GPU performance. Look for the setting called Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling. If your system supports it, go ahead and toggle it on. This feature lets Windows handle GPU tasks more efficiently, reducing latency and giving your games a noticeable performance boost, especially useful for graphically intensive titles. Now that hardware acceleration is active, let's apply specific optimizations for your games. In the same graphics settings window, look for the option that says, choose an app to set preference. Click the drop-down menu and select desktop app, then hit the browse button. This will open a file explorer window where you can select any game you want to optimize. For example, let's add Fortnite. Navigate to the game's install folder, usually found inside Fortnite game, binaries, Win64. From there, select the .exe file. This is the file that launches the game and click add to include it in the list of configurable apps. You can repeat this process for any game you play, like Valorant, CS2 or others. Once the game is added, click the Options button next to it. A new window will pop up with different performance modes. Choose High Performance. This tells Windows to always run the game using your dedicated GPU, not integrated graphics or power saving options. After selecting it, hit Save to lock in your settings. With these changes, you've now enhanced both your GPU control and Windows gaming settings, leading to a smoother and more optimized experience across all your games. The next crucial step to boost your gaming performance is tweaking your GPU control panel settings. Start by launching your GPU's control panel. This could be NVIDIA control panel, AMD Radeon settings, or Intel graphics command center, depending on your system. Once inside, navigate to the section labeled 3D image settings or something similar based on your GPU brand. Scroll through the options until you find power management mode. Click on the drop down menu next to it and change the setting to prefer maximum performance. This forces your GPU to operate at full power at all times during gameplay, rather than down clocking to save energy, which can cause performance drops. Next, locate the option labeled low latency mode and set it to ultra. Enabling this setting reduces input lag and provides a more responsive gaming experience, especially helpful in fast paced competitive titles where every millisecond counts. Once you've made both changes, click apply to save your settings. These control panel tweaks are a simple but powerful way to unlock more consistent frame rates and reduce delay during your gaming sessions. So that's it for today's video guys. If you found this helpful, smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more optimization tips. Catch you in the next one. Peace out.